Psychonauts 2 contains artistic interpretations of serious mental conditions, including addiction, PTSD, panic attacks, anxiety, and delusions. There are also images that may be upsetting to people with a fear of dentistry, tight spaces, or vomit. Good thing I'm cool with dentistry, tight spaces, and vomit. Dear True Psychic Tales magazine, it's me again, Rasputin Aquato. I know Hi, Raz. a lot, and you haven't printed any of my True Psychic submissions so far, but this one's oh. different. Oh, this, this voice. true. I just helped rescue Truman Zanotto, the grand head of the Psychonauts, and father of Lily Zanotto, my girlfriend. Although still the girlfriend. Is still very fresh and might need fact checking before we go to print. There was a kiss, but okay, I'm already getting off track. Let me start at the beginning. I grew up in the circus. It's a very good place to start. The Aquato Family Circus, a ragtag little caravan of acrobats run by my parents. We were taught all our lives to hate and fear psychics, or fortune tellers as we knew them, all because of some old thing where they cursed the Aquatos to die in water. Problem is, I am psychic. I have been all my life. I Spoiler. I my powers from my family, practicing them in secret until one fateful night. After a show, a mysterious stranger handed me a brochure for Whispering Rock Psychic Summer Camp, a training facility for psychic kids operated by the International Espionage Agency we all know as bum, 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 the Psychonauts. I read okay, so that's the entire first game night. recapped. When I got to Whispering no need to watch my playthrough of it. Seamlessly with the other campers. But Superstar seriously, watch my playthrough of it. Sasha Nine and Mia Vodello taught me levitation and psi blast. I learned pyro and telekinesis from Ford Crawler himself. He was all over camp, literally all over, due to his ability to teleport. He even took up psychic residence in my head, which I could prove to you if you had a piece of bacon. Needless to say, things were going great. The music, the I missed the music the so badly. Of the camp was stealing campers' brains and putting them inside armored death tanks that I guess he was going to use to take over the world or something. I and mean, hiding them in levels camp. that were impossible to navigate. Issues with his father. I mean, who does it, right? Now he's okay. Not great, but okay. Just as Ford Kreller was making me an honorary psychonaut for all my hard work, word came in that Truman Zanotto had been kidnapped. So my fellow psychonauts and I jumped in a jet and set out to find him. Our search led us to an abandoned underwater outpost of the psychonauts in a dangerous part of the ocean known as the Rhombus of Ruin. We found Rhombus Truman of there, Ruin. by Dr. Lobato, unlicensed dentist and amateur brain surgeon. We well, I guess grand we never did get closure on him. He's got Silerium poisoning and can't tell us what happened. We know Lobato wasn't acting alone, but he won't tell us who hired him to kidnap Truman. Agent Nine has an idea how He's to keep his mouth shut. Using an elaborate antithetical for a dentist planted in Lobato's mind. It's risky, <clears> but that's just a way of life when you're a psychonaut. That's just a Tuesday. That, I really hope you consider publishing my letter. And also, please consider the sample layout and illustrations I included. <laughs> oh, he drew Better all that, huh? Head in the right place. A talented the young man. Is about to be oh, look at that. That is so cool. Look at how good they made Mia look. Holy cow. Press any button. Where's the any button on this? Oh, I am so excited to be playing this. All right, definitely new game. Now, though, the way you navigated the menu in the first game was uh, a little bit more meta, right? Where they actually had a lot of fun with the menu structure. Doesn't look like they're having as much fun with it this time around. That's okay. It's still a very pretty brain. A brain that's going to take a minute to load the level, I suppose. <laughs> it's going to take a minute to load the loading screen before it loads the level. Hey, here we go. Progress. Three days ago, Truman Zanotto, the grand head of the Psychonauts, was kidnapped. Every everybody got that? Truman Zanotto, head of the Psychonauts? With my help. 
The Psychonauts rescued Truman from the underwater lair of Dr. Lobato. I, yeah, well, I need to know what happened to this no guy. There's no way Lobato is working alone. Last time we saw he was blasted into the sky by a sexy turtle daddy. Find out who hired Dr. Lobato to kidnap Truman Zanotto. My name's Raz. My name I'm a Psychonaut. Oh! <laughs> and today is my first official day on the job. Am I psychic? Might be. Oh god, this is real. Oh, this is 100% real. Have you ever wanted to get, like, a job at a place that you knew was important and they show you to where your desk is and it's just a cube farm? Been there. Been there way too many Everything times. Well, not way too many times. One oh. is too many times. <laughs> hey, Lily. Yeah, I don't know. It's just... I've dreamed about working Oh, you're working with your girlfriend, too? Dangerous. I just thought it would be more... You know? Come on! We're going to be late for the morale corral. That's... <laughs> That's one of those little uh, kinetic energy cradles, but they're brains instead of uh, steel balls. I expect no less. The attention to detail in the first game was profits. incredible. Uh, 900% this quarter. 900%? Dang, coach! That's right. Thank you. And that brings us to our next topic. Look at that uh, cravat. Sasha, still have the talking turtle? <gasps> Maury. Sorry, I just like the clapping. It's oh, that wasn't a real meeting he was doing. <laughs> he was just kind of making it up. The, year. the prize for this year's award is an all-expenses-paid tropical vacation. Ooh. Oh, I hope it's me. The winner of this award may be one of our newest members, but he's also one of our most improved. It sounds like they got the original voice cast back together. To Caligosto Loboto. Whoa! Whoa! Go, You're gonna love this vacation package. Hey, uh, uh, oh. have the wall? I, I've never won anything. I've been on a vacation. Well, I that's your problem. Boat, do I? No, darling. Woo! All you need to do is get this vacation request approved by your supervisor. What? Just a formality. You just need to get this form signed by your boss. Okay, so where are they going my with this? Already boss? they've got me asking yes, questions. Darling. Or you could just tell us who your boss is and oh, we could... Oh, there yeah. we go. Maybe he doesn't want this tropical vacation after all. Get back. I want it. I'm employee of the year. Yes, you are, darling. Now off you go. Get that form signed by your boss. Mia looks good in, in business wear. you. The person you work for. Also, okay. so does Sasha. Hurry up, or I take that vacation myself. I really wish I could pull off a cravat, frankly. Rasputin? I'm on him. Here we go. Whack. Keep up with him, Raz, and he'll lead you straight to his boss. Okay, we have our first objective. Okay, I really want to be able to check out all the neat stuff in here, but sheesh. I need to be we'll able to keep up with this guy. Be All right, off you go, y'all. Do I have access to any abilities, powers, things, stay stuff? Close to him, Raz. Don't oh, girl, you know I'm going to, girl. I'm not going to stay too close. Never it's you I'm going to stay casual. close to. I am acting casual. What's just, that? just fly casual. I, said, I love casual Friday. Am I right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The tooth is loose. Don't lose him, Raz. Dude! Oh, hey, here we go. We finally decided to run. Oh! Uh-oh. Uh -oh. I think he suspects something. He's taking countermeasures. Just remember your basic fighting, soldier. Right. Uh, oh, punch. I yeah, that won't raise any suspicions. Me? No, dude, I have to go bust a mad piss. You keep blocking me off. You are following me. All a trick. What's he doodle? I'm not employee of the year. You are in my heart. I'm the greatest dentist of our century. And that's the tooth. All agents, the tooth has gone bad. Repeat, the tooth Sorry. has gone bad. 
Maintain I'm not sorry. Pursuit. We are in position to intercept. Roger. Roger that. There we go. Double jump. All the controls are coming back to me. It's, it's like riding a psychic bicycle. Hi. And you're just going to stand there until I do something? Just, I'm testing out all the other buttons here to see what I have access to. So far, not much. All right. Oh, and look at the little things floating in the sky. Like the little uh, orbs that you get from the light hitting the camera lens. Uh, they were little psychic spirals. Maybe that's how we know Looking that we're in a psychic me. operation here. No, nah, no, I'm not. I already found you. Okay, here I come. Oh, okay. Why are you taking so long? How is it that you're like a psychic supervillain, but also a dentist? What is your career trajectory? The gravity of the situation. Wow. <laughs> Watch out. Oh, okay. Yep. Hey, you're not supposed to walk that way. Hey, quiet, you. This isn't a real office. Uh, push against the wall while in the air to wall slide. Okay. Oh, we are Samus Aroning our way through this. I am all gibbered up on this. This is nuts. No time for small talk. We're only a few minutes in. I'm already deeply move. in love with this but game. Got him cornered this way. I, oh. Wait. Dude, I'm coming. I'm I'm coming. I'm going as fast as I can. How are you so much faster than me? You're like a little potato man. Now, before the procedure, it's very important that we clean out your dentist hat. You don't want any dirty. Wait, huh? Watch out for the potato man! Oh, uh, dodge. Woo! Keep me guessing. I thought I just had to do it that one time. Hi, what are you? Stand down, soldier. I've been bit. Got this giant tooth off of me. Yes, sir, 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 sir. Tooth. There's a door up there. We just need to make some sort of ladder or stairs out of here. I had, like, my, my, uh, telekinesis powers. Oh, hey, there it is. Soldier, extract this enemy molar. Dude, I'm working on it. There we go. Oh, they made this so much more intuitive to use. Uh, what needs a giant tooth? Uh, uh oh, ew. <laughs> oh, them gums is all flappy. Press R2. You go on ahead. It's just that easy. Support. Oh, and there's still figments for me to collect. Lots of figments of Roboto's imagination in here. When you see a figment, suck it up, soldier. Ew. It could have been a different way to put that. I thought the big tooth was upsetting. Well, let's soldier through, Private. Unzip that dental door. Oh, the sound design is good so job, good. Soldier. What's that light? Uh-oh. Zip it back up again. Zip it. No, you zip it! Yeah. Did I miss a figment? It was right there. Cap is clean. Let's check out those chompers. Yeah. <laughs> if I didn't know better, I'd swear this place had gremlins. No problem. I'm sure I can do this in the dark. Gremlins meaning little critters uh, that cause problems uh, with machines. Uh, Not the ones you can't feed after midnight. Coach, Is there anybody out there under 40 who understands that reference? In Sasha's plan. In fact, I think it's a trap. No. <laughs> uh oh. That's just a Was he playing us the whole time? Everybody oh, the sensor gets like a little introduction. Live in your mind. It's like visiting Live old friends. Don't belong. Like us? You handle this one. I'll find a way out. Yep. Super brave of you. Thank you, sir. Yoink. <laughs> uh, okay. Brains represent the strength of Raz's connection to the mental world. When mental energy is depleted, he will res reset to his last mental checkpoint. Got it. Uh, beat the crap out of the sensor. Oh, they have health bars now. Sensors can be stunned by throwing objects at them with telekinesis. Okay, use the force. Noted. Uh, Kabu. 
And I got a trophy. Man, I feel like I'm accomplishing all sorts of things. Now, have you ever had that feeling where you're playing a game and it's a game that you haven't played for a long time, but you return to? Or you're playing the sequel like I'm doing and it feels like visiting old friends. It's just warm and comfortable and you're just like, oh, I missed you guys. Just have to do your thing with the dental door here. I'm having that oh. feeling right now. I can't even look at it. So you have a dental phobia. This could make you a liability, sir. Okay, let's talk about the figments. If you remember from my playthrough of Psychonauts 1, or like how they just explained here, figments are just kind of littered throughout each map, and if you collect enough of them, you gain a level, and the more levels you gain, you're able to like get new abilities and whatnot. I don't know how they're gonna tweak it for this game, but I'm also not going to be a super completionist boy about getting all the things. It's kind of my vibe here. Uh, oh, there you go. Oh, it looks like they're doing the luggage tags too. That's yes. also a collectible Got in each the level. Back tag. Got the duffel bag tag. All right. They're definitely giving Richard Horvitz plenty of lines for him to sink his teeth into. Oh, and they're not doing any of the obnoxious crying. They're still crying, but it's not super obtrusive like it was. They've already made so many uh, uh, upgrades, so many improvements to the game. Oh. Okay, what else do we have? Is that everything? I think that's all the figments. Are there still mental cobwebs, too? That was another thing that they had in each level. Or is that just a figment? Let's check it out. No, those are figments. Oh, wow. The things you can stand on are movable in the terrain. That's going to make for some very interesting and possibly very annoying puzzles. Okay, so how do I get you guys? Oh, hi. This is how. Maybe if I just pay attention to how the game wants me to play it. They made that really easy. That was the thing that took me the longest to get the hang of in Super Metroid was the wall jumps, just because the controls for it were so tricky. But hell, that was 30-something years ago. They've certainly made improvements to how that stuff works. All right, Coach, what up, my dude? Coach, is this normal? Do Sasha's mental scenarios usually break down like this? Never. There's something screwy going on in this brain. The sooner we get out of it, the better. Roger Dodger. Hey, see what you can find that way. See you on the Can't other do. side. Ah, Looks like some sort of conference room in here. Rasputin, is that you? I know. Oh, the door disappeared. Coming, Sasha. <laughs> clever, very clever. Hmm. Sounds like there's some emotional baggage nearby. Uh -huh. try and get that sorted. Everyone has emotional baggage that needs to be sorted. You can help out by finding this bag's lost tag. Every five you reunite will grant you a rank. Oh, okay. Sorry, we're dog sitting uh, my parents' dog while they're out of town, and uh, she does not like the mail carrier a single bit. She's the sweetest dog in the world. But if you're a mail carrier, God help you. All right. Milton, careful. It's a oof. Aha. It's a oof? Here's What's an oof? Fox tag. Someone is helping him. He couldn't. Oh, ew. He's getting boxed in the face by a uvula. He couldn't do this himself. The oof. Oof. Countermeasures too strong. Oh, wait. Milton, Dang it. It's how, how is that chasing me back? Uh, press R1 to blast concentrated beams of psychic energy oh, from your face. Oh, thank you, Rasputin. There Please, we go. Let's get clear of this aggressive uvula. All right, in we go. Sasha, how is Lobato breaking through the office construct? He couldn't be doing this on his own. He must be getting help from someone even more... Sinister. Sinister. Get ready, Rasputin. 
Oh, I'm ready. Uh, we gotta break through all these chattering teeth, huh? Here. Yeah, let's just start firing off. Keep moving forward, Rasputin. Okay, I don't have ammo for this anymore either. It's just a cooldown period. Sasha! I ooh, I've got the situation under our oh, control. I don't think ah. you do, sir. Just find us a way out of here quickly. Yeah, don't bother with them, little moose. <laughs> you want to go for the gold. You got to grab the big boys. Help me carry this one, will you, Frankie? Yeah, you got it, boss. You know that's real gold in that tooth there, right? Yeah, of course I know that. Why do you think we're trying to boost it? Come on, Frankie. Put a little muscle into it. I don't got any muscle, boss. I'm just a tooth with wings that's been slightly anthropomorphized. Uh, figments, please. Thank you very much. Now, I'm sure there's hey, some sort of achievement you get if you get all of the figments. It's not yours, and I need to jump on it. I can't believe this. Ah, they got me too, Frankie. The mooks. <laughs> eh, Buffanopoly. We're not going to forget this, you see. We're going to come visit you back when you least expects it. Yeah. We're gonna live to make sure you pay for that actions which hurt me and my family. Or so I ain't the tooth fairy. Figments, please. So a little bit of backstory on how Psychonauts 2 came about. Uh, because the first Psychonauts came out like 20 years ago. Almost right at 20 years ago by the time these episodes come out. Honestly, it's a mess in there. Yes, I did! Yeah. Rinse and spit. Okay, handsome! Ah! Oh. Now, everything that doesn't belong. Bloosh! Oh no. Not back in the trap. Trap? Coach? Coach, where'd he go? Oh, well, that's a good sign. What is it? That is a regret. If Lobato has regrets, then maybe there's a way we can still get to him. Let's get Thanks, out of here Sasha. and find Lobato. Uh, Sasha? Are regrets dangerous? Oh, yes, extremely. Take care of that one, will you, while I find an exit? <laughs> oh, yeah, they'll fuck you up bad. Don't let them anywhere near your face. <laughs> the last guy who did that? Oh, you don't even want to know. Anyway, bye! Okay, press R to lock on. Fantastic. Uh, bam, ba bam, bam, bam. No. Hey, listen. You go stamp someone else, you stampy bastard. All right, what was I saying? A little bit about how this game ended up getting made. Because the first one came out 20 years ago. Oh. Wait, what just happened? Did I just die? I think I just died. Anyway, the problem was that even though the game was an unparalleled stroke of brilliance, it didn't sell very well. It was uh, very, very well received by all the people who did buy it, but it didn't become a commercial success. And so uh, it just sort of got shelved somewhere until, uh, you know, some uh, venture capitalist group, some brand bought the rights to it. And uh, Tim Schaefer, the creator of the project, was able to kind of scrape together enough money to buy the rights back from that brand so that he could make sure it got released onto current gen platforms like back in, in 2011 Honestly, or something like that. A mess in there. Yeah, I died. I have to start yeah. over. Oh, let's let's and spit. skip. And so once it was released on virtual consoles kind of uh, across everywhere, it sold like uh, hotcakes and became extremely popular. And that's what built the momentum for a sequel to be made. And so everything was going hunky-dory. Uh, Double Fine Studios had signed with a publishing company. And uh, they were getting... Ow, okay. And they were getting ready to start making the game when that publishing company went out of business. Like, they had to file Good for bankruptcy. Unfortunately, I can't find a way out of here anywhere. Uh, yeah, Sasha? thanks for all your help, dude. How long has that golden door been there? Golden what? Did somebody <laughs> the golden say what now? gold? Frankie, here's our <laughs> chance for revenge. 
Oh, not these guys. Never mind the fact that gold is prohibitively heavy and will probably cause severe structural damage to our tooths that are our bodies. But let's fly it away anyways. Watch out! They're shooting at us! Frankie! Frankie? Oh no! Out again! I'm and so, to anyway, to finish up my story. <laughs> Clonk! Rasputin. You it was unfettered capitalism that, that came to the I'm rescue going to for stay this. Here and attempt to repair my construct. All right, you and your precious construct, Sasha. Unfettered capitalism that allowed this to succeed because Microsoft came in and bought the defunct publishing company, and with it, the rights to publish the game. And so they stepped in and they said, don't worry, Tim Schafer and Double Fine. We have uh, bottomless pockets and we know that this game is going to make a buttload of money. So you make the game that you want. And that's exactly what happened. Uh, Double Fine cozied up to Microsoft. They uh, didn't have to cut any of the content. Microsoft pretty much rubber stamped everything that they wanted to make for the game. And here we are uh, playing it a couple of years later after it came out because uh, I'm nothing if not timely. So while unfettered capitalism does in fact have its uh, little niggles issues that I take umbrage with, it did result in them supporting talented and motivated artists and programmers to make a delightful game that is delightful so far. So fringe benefit, I suppose. Oh, this is not getting any better. Ross, no, it's not. Is that you? Come down Sw here. Lily, Sweetie baby. You, you got it, sugar biscuits. Certainly not the worst office building I've ever seen. Here I come! Oh, sliding times! I'm sliding right towards you, dear heart! Oh, no, still can't touch water. Never got closure on that either in the first game. Still got that water phobia, huh? You got it, sugar britches. Back in Gruovia, my whole family was cursed to die in water. And Yeah, yeah, super sad. Look at these posters! Aren't they amazing? I think someone else planted these in Lobato's mind to intimidate him. And make sure he didn't tell us who hired him to kidnap your dad. Let's get rid of them. Maybe it'll the help. the texture on Raz's helmet. Help me burn these posters, Raz. You got it, butter baby. Uh, L1 to charge pyrokinesis. Oh, thank God. I don't have to go through a menu structure to change my powers out. That was the thing I hated about the first game the most, if I hated anything. It was just a little cumbersome. Charging pyrokinesis. Uh, charge him up. Then release to set things on fire. Ah, skoosh. Do I have to do this one at a time? All right. Charge him up, charge him up, charge him up, charge him up. Yeah, die a horrible, painful, burning death. Okay, the fire doesn't hurt me either. That's good to know. Wait, do I? I don't have to burn all of them, okay? I'm not gonna burn your poster, darling. Mwah. Wait, what? What happens if I do this? Nothing there. Can I? Can I burn Lily's poster? Ah, fire! It hurts. Lily. Sorry, baby cakes. I had to test it and find out. Uh, can I burn all of these too? Yeah, these are all interactable, interactable, interactable objects. It's not like We're I, not here to you know, you. have to we talk to make to this work. We just want to hired you to kidnap Truman Zanotto. Why can't you just let it go? Oh, well, that ends well. Ah! Okay, just like in the first game, I get three touches to water and then I uh, get backed out. Noted. So platforming is still going to be an issue in this game, isn't it? <laughs> oh, boy. Uh, is that you who were talking to me? What if I burnt you to cinders? 
All right, progress. Nothing else I need there, although, was there a figment floating around? I could have sworn I saw one. Here we go. Uh, gimme. Buh. And you, sir. How about I burn you? Oh, I burnt the hole behind you. Well, now I kind of have my choice of where to go. Let's go here. Yep. Oh, the hat box. Yay! He's so happy! Look at his derpy little face. One tagged hat box. What do we got here? Oh, 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 water. Okay. Hi, handsome! Kaboosh! Oh, I was hoping for more secrets. All right, fine. Uh, jump. Jump. Oh, and there's a shadow so I can gauge where I am in my jump. Who are you oh. protecting? Myself. It's, it's like uh, living some kind of crazy luxury life. Look at all these improvements. Fantastic. Loose lips, yep. sink ships. Oh, sink drips. Okay, I hear you whining. That's the handbag. Don't got the tag for you. Did I miss that somewhere? What if I did one of these? Karoosh! No, you're not. You're lying. Was that you screaming? Or me? Doesn't matter. Listen, we all have our doubts and regrets. But it's too late to turn back now. Understand? What we have to do now is finish the extraction. That's not Lovato. Oh, I missed the Dude, handbag. I think Lovato is starting to have doubts. Duh, they're right over there. <laughs> Hi, guys. Luckily, they're highly flammable. Like you all take doubts. Care of them I find a way out, okay? All right, honey baby. You leave this to me. Hoo ha! Uh, Dowdykins? Oh, hi. Uh, Kamush! Oh, I missed. Okay, noted. Okay, the AoE on that's a little tricky. Not gonna lie. No. Kamush! Never had any. Psypop, this brain candy will restore some of your mental energy. Hold down to gobble a Psypop. Hey, if there's a Psypop, what needs goblin? Raj, I'm the man for the job. Oh, wow. Okay, they're not holding back. <laughs> like, all right, smart guy. You think you know this game well enough? Well, then here, take eight different enemies at once. Okay, yeah, one pyrokinesis is enough to take those guys down. And those sensors really hurt. Citanium. Citanium is a psychoreactive material used by psychonauts as currency. Save it up to buy some useful stuff later. Can do. Oh, thank you. It's only my third try. Okay, what I could really use is an update on my uh, uh, cooldown time, because my god, this takes forever. Uh, yes, I will take that. Thank you. That didn't do much. Ow, ow, ow. It kept a lot of the same sound effects. That's good to see. Oh, man, these things do screw you up. Uh, hiya. Okay, we good? Doesn't this painting look familiar? Yeah, I've only burned like eight of them so far. Think we should burn it? Yes, burn! Come on, just tell us who hired you to kidnap my dad. We'll stop burning you if you do. Did I lose all my stuff? Well, I'm sorry, you were offended. That does it. I'm burning You go for it, darling sweetie. Was... 
All right, I'm missing out on some fantastic banter here. Oh my God, look at the teeth. Sure, that's what happened. I don't believe you. Lily, you gonna burn this guy or what? All right, sweetie baby, you, you gonna take a crack at it or are you waiting on me? Okay, all me, I suppose. Kaboosh! I wanted to give you the opportunity. You seem so jazzed to do it. I just did. Hi. How are you doing? Did you forget everything I taught you about levitation, Rasputin? No. Your thoughts can lift you up if you focus. Yeah, although hurry, that's kind of not how it worked in the first game. That, uh, L2. Ha! Now let's get out of here. Woo! Woo! Yes. Wait, help Lovato. Someone really did a number on that poor thing. I think he wants to tell us who hired him, but he's terrified. Let's He's putting up a gruff it. facade, you see? All right. Oh, man. This, uh, this... Oh, man. This tutorial level is going on a spell, and this, uh... Okay, so this tutorial level has gone on a spell, and the episode's starting to run a little long. So why don't we go ahead and cut it here, and we'll see if we can finish this up in the next episode. I am having so much fun being back in this world, and I hope you all are enjoying it, too. Uh, there's more I can say about it, but we're out of time for today. Bye.